हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक ऑन इस चैनल गाइज आई एम राम के सिंह यूनिटी गेम डेवलपर यूट्यूबर एंड ब्लॉगर सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विथ यू दैट हाउ यू कैन इंटीग्रेट रेडी प्लेयर मी विथ मूवमेंट एस डी के सो लेट्स स्टार्ट द टू डी वीडियो सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर विथ यू दैट इफ यू आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट अ मेटा मूवमेंट एस डी के सो दैट शुड बी ऑन रेडी प्लेयर मी इज द टेम्पलेट अवतार बी ऑन देयर एंड वेन एवर यू आर लोडिंग यूर अवतार रन टाइम एट दैट टाइम यू हैव टू जस्ट लोड यूर अवतार एंड देन ट्रांसफर द दैट मेज ऑन दिस पर्टिकुलर मेज so let's start the today video expecting that you have install your rpm package ready player me package in last tutorial i did if you have not so just go and watch after that you have to go in the package and in package put ready player me core and then here is the resources earlier there was only ready player me author now they are giving the rpm template author for xr but for xr today is 27 april 2024 so currently they are saying that for the using the author for using the for xr you have to mail them they will enable for particular application then you can use maybe after 2 to 3 months they just enable for public currently it is in testing we are going with rpm template author so first of all we have to create one character so you can say that is the player or you can say character and position you have to just reset it and i have already done the meta movement tutorial but there is something different in rpm so that's why i am creating tutorial again but uh, after this basic locomotion thing you can follow from that video i will just share that how you can integrate the meta movement sdk so here is the rpm author so just do in the character and here you can see latest version of rpm it is not breaking anything because in last part it was breaking if it is breaking in your part so here you can see make sure that you have passed the mesh that is the this wolf 3d author and make sure that you have passed the material thing if it is not there okay great and here you can see that is the masculine it is have been added so it is currently in the package if you are going to change anything so here is the masculine if you are going to change any configuration because we have to change the configuration so it is not going to take because it is inside the package so it will not work what we have to do masculine means man male and for fem mean you use to feminine and whenever we will use the xr so at that time we will use this feminine xr and masculine so currently i am showing with this so you need female and male so just go in the explorer and copy this files after the copy the file you have to go in the asset in asset you have to create one more folder that is the animator author so this is the thing you have to do in ready player me whenever you are going to integrate so i have just put in that folder so let me check so in the asset you will see animator author and here is the masculine so here is the rig setup so it is currently generic for using the meta movement sdk you have to choose the humanoid and just apply here after that here is the configuration so you have to just choose the configuration and you have to go in the muscle and setting and here is the translation dof so you have to just turn on so that you can use it so just apply and then done so now you can use this masculine and here is a feminine so basically you have to go in the and you have to just apply here and configuration so muscle and do app so whenever you are going to use anything so you have to check that which author you are using if it is not currently on so at that time you have to use and whenever you are going to use in application so at that time you have to check the gender type of the author it may be male female so at that time on the basis of that you have to change this author and for the xr they are just changing some structure bone structure of character so that will be a very useful whenever it will come so i will see and then create the tutorial currently we are passing this one and whenever you we will pass the locomotion so at that time you have to add the locomotion animation so i am not going to do the locomotion structure will be same whenever you will visit the my channel nested mango i have showed you that how you can implement the locomotion here every process will be same like in last tutorial i explained to you that how you can implement the meta movement sdk so basically you have to go on the character and here is the animator so everything is okay and on the game object okay so currently we have added the animator with the rpm template author so here you are going to load your author means whenever you are going to use so you have to create the prefab of it and then you have to use on the basis of what uh, the gender of your author is and here is the building blocks so you have to add the camera rig so just add camera rig 
so currently we have the camera rig in the inspector you have to check the basic but most of cases is okay quest 3 supported and then floor level then controllers and hands it should be this and then here is the body tracking is supported so great we are ready to go so just go on the character click here and then you have to go on the meta moment samples if you have not this sdk so just go and watch my tutorial so that you get idea that how you can integrate because these are the package you have to integrate and on the body tracking you have to add animation rigging retargeting body constraints so just do this one so it is saying that we cannot apply on the parent so we have to choose this one because here is the animator so it is asking for animator so again go on the game object and the samples body tracking and here you have to on animation rigging retargeting body full constraint so just do this part on this one so that you can see that what's going on here we are getting the rig currently we are getting everything set up now you have to create the build and run so your and one thing you have to make sure that this position is zero this position is zero because meta movement work on the zero zero position so this is the basic setup means you will be able to track your hand your legs everything will be work so just create the build for the locomotion stuff you have to follow same thing the new thing was to create anime animator avatar and then you have to change on humanite and then you have to on dof dof thing so that's it for 2d tutorial and just create the build and run you will it will work perfectly so thanks for watching have a good day see you in next video bye bye take care if you want to ask anything so just let me know in the comment box support the channel like the video subscribe the channel and support me on the patreon bye bye take care